exercise might be a secret weapon for boosting brain power in autism, according to some interesting new research. In a recent study, scientists discovered that adolescent rats with autism-like symptoms showed improvements in brain function and cognitive abilities after just a few weeks of treadmill exercise. Autism spectrum disorder is a condition that affects communication, social interaction, and cognitive flexibility, the ability to switch between different tasks or thoughts. These challenges can make everyday life more difficult for individuals with autism. Scientists have known for a while that exercise helps improve cognitive function in various conditions, including autism, but they wanted to dig deeper into how this works. The researchers focused on a protein called brain-derived neurotrophic factor, or BDNF, which is crucial for learning and memory. They also looked at two other molecules, irisin and interleukin-6, which are linked to brain health and are produced during exercise. Their goal was to see if regular exercise could tweak these molecules in a way that would benefit brain function in rats, showing autism-like behaviors. To test this, they had adolescent rats run on a treadmill for 30 minutes a day, five days a week for four weeks. They then measured how well the rats could switch between tasks, which is a key measure of cognitive flexibility. Female rats showed significant improvements in their ability to adapt and think flexibly, especially in the final stages of the tasks. The male rats also improved, but their results were a bit more mixed, with some setbacks in the more challenging parts of the tasks. On a molecular level, the exercise boosted BDNF levels in the brain, which is a good sign that the brain was becoming more adaptable. Interestingly, the effects of exercise on other molecules like irisin and interleukin-6 varied between males and females, suggesting that exercise might affect the brains of males and females differently. This study hints that even low-intensity exercise could be a valuable tool in improving cognitive function in autism, potentially leading to better targeted treatments in the future. If you're curious about how these findings could translate to humans or want to explore more about the science behind it, check out the full article on scipost.org.